Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. I am Starco Gaming and we are back with another Dragon Champion video, guys. If you are level 15 or below, make sure to use the promo code Starco to get a free starter pack to do so. It is pretty simple, guys. You go in the settings, use the promo code, and you enter the code Starco, S-T-A-R-K-O, you press OK, and you will receive a free starter pack. And also, guys, if you're watching this, during the firework day uh competitive events you can also use the uh promo code fireworks 2021 and you will receive a few extra goodies so use both promo code if you're level 15 or below guys or Use only this promo code if you are level 16 or above. So, uh, yeah, that's the promo code for today's video, guys. So, guys, today it is a Friday, which mean devlog day, guys. Last week we skipped the devlog day because, um, well, I felt uh, underwhelming. Uh, I was expecting a little bit more substance into the devlog, so I kind of skipped it. And I guess that was actually a good move because both last week and this week are related. So we're going to be able to take a look at both devlogs and uh, actually see what's happening, man. See what is happening. So let's bring the Discord server here. And here we go. So last week on 7 9 2021, uh, Lesser Brett was here with greetings, champion, for today's devlog. We have quite an unusual hero to show. Let's take a look at the, the early sketch. So that was the first sketch, which is a very, very, very early sketch, as you can see, with the drawing. Then the second post was who is she the weapon looks kind of demon-esque doesn't it so kind of trying to make you think that she might actually be a demon character if we look a little bit more sketch you can see the weapon the dragon coming out the weapon is actually pretty damn cool i do love that weapon uh, setup and uh, also i'm pretty sure this uh, new character whenever it comes uh, is actually going to be uh, a blind characters a little bit like master Joe, and the characters really look like a demon if we actually see the third post here maybe looking at her at her in color will make more sense of what the story and the origin is what do you think so uh if we answer that question from last week devil i guess i think that she looks pretty awesome i did expect her to actually be a kind of a demon you know because of the red purple uh color in the skin and uh you know that would have been cool if the weapons were actually her end uh, i think that would have been a little bit better maybe they listen to me and want me make some changes but apparently she is not a demon but i do love the look guys it's gonna be interesting is she gonna be a ranger is she gonna be uh, a mage or whatever that's gonna be very very interesting to see what she is because uh, you know or is she gonna be you know a full pleasure melee warrior because she could be you know a ranged warrior that could be interesting uh, because of the sword but is she gonna be melee or ranged warrior that's gonna be very interesting since she can shoot uh, fire out of those uh swords which is actually pretty interesting okay so guys if we go back now to this week devlogs greetings champion last week we introduced you to an unusual looking human warrior champion today we are happy to show our finished three-day model animation and visual effect let's take a look so let's jump on this post here this video and the let's take a look the, the 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 quality is terrible they should upload in hd man anyway this is the 3d look guys she looks actually pretty dope you can see um if we go back really really fast here okay right here you can see the sword are actually ready to open here which is actually pretty pretty awesome but she looks barefoot come on give her shoes man nobody likes to walk barefoot outside here are some goddamn shoes. It ain't that expensive to get some shoes. I love the fire air. Uh, it's actually pretty damn interesting here. And you can see her here. Uh, we're going to see her in action. So we have uh, one of the ability here, which is actually melee, which is quite interesting. See a melee slash with the uh, boat sword. 
you know, the fire come out of the swords and then a uh, little melee ability, a range ability. So that answered the question. She's going to be able to do both range attack and a melee attack, which is actually quite interesting. And the last kill is we have no idea. Oh, it's a healing ability. What? What? Healing ability, man. So, basically, this warrior is going to be able to do melee attack, range attack, and healing ability. So, that is actually quite interesting. My guess is that that skill we saw with the healing ability, which I'm guessing is third skill, is going to be a buff skill, which means we're going to probably gonna get like a... Potency increase or uh, critical rate, critical damage increase or something like that. That will also heal you at the same time. Self-healing ability. That is my guess. Well, it's self-healing because when they use it in the other team here. Uh, we're gonna sh They're going to show it again in a sec here. There we go. Uh, she's going to start. She does the healing, but I mean this one. See, uh, the number healing number is only for her. See the, the, the green? It's only for her. It's not for the person in the same team. So that's going to be a self-healing ability based on something uh, related to her kid. So that's actually going to be quite interesting. It's always nice to see a character that can actually... Uh, is DPS characters that can actually heal uh, him or herself. So that's actually pretty quite interesting. I'm a little bit excited about this, to be honest. She looks pretty dope. New human is definitely something that... That we will be very, very, very happy. I'll tell. I really wish they give her some shoes, some sandals, some something, man. Uh, you know, barefoot on the floor. You know, when you're walking on burning ground, that must hurt your feet, man. So, that would be nice if she actually gets some shoes. But anyway, guys, let me know what you guys think of this devlogs for the last couple of weeks. Do you think that this character actually looks interesting? Do, this, do you think that this character looks pretty boring? Let me know in the comment section, guys, as always. So, guys, uh, thank you for watching uh, this video. Thank you for being part of my amazing community. And, guys, I'll see you again in the next video. Thank you.